Hello, everyone, and welcome to the podcast for Bittersweet Symphony, Part 1, the first new episode of 2013, and the start of the final batch of episodes of Season 12. Now, we all know that Part 2 is going to be completely shocking, as we've seen in the promo that just aired on TV. Now, I haven't really read a lot of the press releases or anything. Like I said, I'm trying as of late to, you know, stay in the dark as much as possible. I'm assuming that Cam um, commits suicide or attempts suicide. I don't know. I mean, the promo basically gave that away. But at the same time, you know, Teen Nick is always trying to mislead and, and do things. So, you know, I don't know what really will happen. Um... But it definitely looks like a very shocking episode, regardless of what does happen. And, you know, and I don't know why they didn't just air it as an hour. I mean, I guess they wanted to build the anticipation of the episode. But at the same time, you know, that preview for next week kind of just gives away, you know, a lot of stuff. But tonight's episode was pretty good. You know, the stuff with Cam um, was absolutely great, you know. Uh, the actor who portrays Cam is, you know, fantastic. And the scene with him and Ellie in the classroom was, you know, a great scene. That was a fantastic scene. Um, you know, just the stuff with, with Cam and Maya, you know, just really good stuff. So if, you know, his character does leave the show, you know, I don't know, um, I definitely would, would be, you know, pretty sad. You know, Cam has turned into a really great character, and, you know, I really enjoyed watching him and, you know, the episodes that he was on for. But at the same time, I think it will help Maya develop into an even more complex and interesting character. You know, she, you know, is one of my favorite of the new batch. And, you know, going through something like this, you know, whatever Cam is going to do and, you know, whatever is going to happen, I think it will help her character really even blossom into, you know, something even better. As for the Dallas and Allie stuff, you know, I mean, it's all right. Um... You know, I'm not the biggest fan of them together. You know, it wasn't a bad plot or anything. It just, you know, wasn't the most interesting thing. Um, Claire and Eli stuff, you know, the locker things, you know, kind of interesting. People moving into a locker and, you know, preparing for uh, the dorms, Eli said, which, you know, great continuity. They also had a scene up, you know, in the gardens that uh, Jake made. You know, a lot of continuity, good stuff there. Um... The journal, the, the, you know, secret, quote-unquote secret, I mean, I don't know if that necessarily is something that w should be so shocking to Eli. I mean, I guess he's so, you know, delusional to think that Claire, you know, could never love anyone else and would never love anyone else. And I guess a lot of the the uh, Eli and Claire fans, the E. Claire fans, believe the same thing, Um but, you know, I mean, it wasn't a bad plot. Um, you know, I, I do like them, and like I said, I always enjoy when they're not, you know, the main forefront of an episode, and they're kind of, you know, in the background doing their thing, and, you know, it will, it will definitely be interesting to see where it goes, you know, with them. I'm very excited, you know, for part two. Um, I wish it would have been an hour tonight. I, it was supposed to be an hour, and then they changed it, and, you know, all this kind of stuff, but... Definitely excited for next week to find out what exactly will happen. You know, another thing of note, um, the fight scene with uh, Cam and Zig was actually pretty good. You know, there's been times on the show when the fights have kind of looked cheesy and fake. But, I mean, just a lot of the fighting and the action, the emotion tonight, especially from Cam, was, you know, really top-notch and really well done. So I definitely have to praise the show in that regard. Overall, a decent episode. Obviously, it would be much well, you know, held in regards viewing the second part with it. But, you know, you have to do, you know, with what you're given. Uh, thank you so much, everyone, for listening to the podcast. And I will talk to you all next week for what seems to be a very shocking, exciting, and great drama-filled episode of Degrassi.